Put on your goggles. It's time for another two-minute tech tip. Hi, I'm Bob Rubart with the Oracle Technology Network, and back for his third two-minute tech tip is Rob Lockard. Rob is the president of OracleWizard.com, and he has over 30 years' experience as an Oracle DBA, designer, and developer. So let's drop the clock on Rob's tip and see how he does. Clock starts now. Good morning. For this two-minute tech tip, we're going to be covering Oracle's transparent data encryption, where data may leak, and how to mitigate those leakages. With TDE, you can encrypt table spaces, columns, external tables, uh, RMAN backups, data pump. So the first thing we're going to do is table spaces. All right, we're going to be copying unsecure information from a table space into an encrypted table space. And we have several options to do it. We can do move our DMS redefinitions, create table as, etc. But anyways, we're going to get the information over there. Once we have the, a table over there, we create an index on this table. That index must reside in the encrypted table space. If it does not, it will be viewable in the data file. Next thing we do is we create a materialized view on this information. Again, the materialized view must reside within the encrypted table space because if it's over here, again, it will be readable in the data file. But once we've moved the information over, we have ghost data over here. Now, with ghost data, what we're going to do is we're going to do, we're going to drop the table space and then we're going to do shred on the data files to get rid of any of the information. Now, column encryption is secure, right? Well, not exactly. If you gather histogram information on sensitive columns, that data will appear in the statistics tables. So in order to mitigate that risk, you have two options. You can either A, not gather histogram information on sensitive information, or B, use database vault to wall off that information from unauthorized users. Let us know what you think of Rob's tip. Leave a comment or click one of the thumb icons below this video. Stay tuned.